know, there, there are so many miniatures to paint in, a, in an army and when you want to get ready for, for a tournament, it can be quite tedious over time. And for, uh, for our listeners, if you don't know, what well, Orangi is a veteran player from, from many tournaments. He has experience, uh, contrary, <laughs> contrary to me, uh, you know, I've participated in maybe one tournament. So we're not, I, I'm not really a tournament player. Uh, we play Warhammer 40k more casually than uh, competitively. We still like it. Uh, we still talk on the topics, you know, of going, uh, you know, what is competitive and what is not competitive, so to say, the most played miniatures and everything. Uh, so yeah, well, you, you did you, you did participate in a couple of tournaments, and I remember one time you even. Uh, I, I got uh, a serious ass kicking from one of your uh, Space Marine tournament list. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, I mean, you challenged me to do uh, something really hard for you, and yeah, that's what happened. It did work. <laughs> it did work. I, I didn't see it coming. It was the era of the Smash Captain. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, that one, yeah. The, well, I mean... The game before the the, the uh, a few weeks before that you did the like I, I went easy on you so you did like kick my ass really hard with the, <laughs> your uh, sneaky bane blade as a tile iron. so I was like okay well I, I need to step up a bit I did I did yeah I, I did deserve I deserve that I deserve that totally the the uh, like the bane blade behind the post thing. Yeah, and the the sentinels that are rushing to lock you down, stuff like that. I was like, okay. Exactly. I think right, we I did something like this with yeah, and you were playing custodies. Uh, yeah, exactly. And you tabled me basically. <laughs> you were playing custodies, and they, and they were not they were not that strong in that edition compared to what they are right now. And uh, yeah, I remember that game. It was quite it, it was it was quite an ass beating. I remember. <laughs> yeah yeah because uh, custodies at the time well even now they don't have much answers to uh, big armor um since they are really more of a melee focus and when you go through uh, a bane blade that has a invulnerable save minus to hit and stuff like that it, it, it's pretty challenging because there's so much wound that not in a single phase you can get rid of it especially as custodies the other there's other armies that has like way to do tons of damage in a single round of uh, close combat but in that period of time custodies were so uh, up and down because they all oh, most of the damage were the d3s or d6 so you oh could my. never uh, be sure if you were able to to do enough runes to get something out of the table yeah custody yeah custodies definitely improved their uh competitively speaking they did improve their uh their effectiveness compared to what they used to be like it's a very elite it's a heavy elite army and uh yeah. I, I was I, I wasn't um really used to play against them I, and i'm i'm still not it's still a challenge i'd like to face at some point i'll probably get my uh, my ass kicked <laughs> uh um, yeah i think so I, th I think I would because the the um the, there is there, there was something because for for the people um in, in, uh, for, for the people joining us right now uh, I used to be a heavy Astramilitarum player since fifth edition I really liked the army and the uh, and the faction and um, I always thought I wanted to to do the Chaos Space Marine thing and that's that's why. Uh, I am uh, going heavy on Space Marine right now. It, it's way funnier to play. I like it better. It's it's tougher. It's uh, it it's heavier, heavier, and there's more than way to play rather than you know the uh, like Astra Militarum have uh, have this uh, one sided strategy with you know artillery and infantry right now. It's not really. Like you don't have any versatility. You can play your Lemon Rosses and Chimeras and Infantry, but in the end, what will do the heavy lifting are the Basilisk and uh, all the Altery like Manticores and um, what it is. Is it is it a Manticore? 
yeah, it's the it's the manticore. The wyvern is not really used. It's not used that much uh, anymore. It, it, it's it, they, they really go heavy on on the basilisk and the manticores to do all the heavy lifting right now, and uh, it's quite a shame because like the the whole army has has went to a single mono playable uh, strategy faction and that's kind of that, that's kind of a, of a let down in the end you know yeah well i mean and not only that is i think uh astro Militarum is a pain in the butt to uh to play because yeah you, you, need, to, you need to think of so much stuff especially when you, you need how to manage your troop correctly because the, the name of the game is to use your troop to con to control objectives and stuff like that and you don't want to waste your troops with stupid charge or just sacrificing <laughs> for nothing your troops so it, I, I found that it, it's a bit more complex in term yeah in terms of like auras well now the auras are gone but the um the the placement and preparing and thinking of what the opponents will do so that you try to minimize the effect on of what you'll do in the next round on your army so I, I found it is really hard even though like the models are really nice i do enjoy the the concept of the of the un of the army but it, it's a bit hard it kind of turned into like a finnis finnis army uh rather than what it used to be uh, mm. yeah you need a lot of preparing for your orders and everything and for me it's kind of really it's kind of a let down uh it, it used to be simple to play and uh, i don't want you know when i'm playing a game of 40k um i don't want to think too much uh, i want to think about you know the the objective plays and the uh you know what needs to be done and, and when i find myself trying to find out what is the best strategy mid game to actually achieve something just achieve something not even winning it's really uh it's not the satisfying area in which i want to find myself in so adds the you know the change uh, the change of heart and going through uh going i'm um, sorry going with the chaos space marine um anyway it's re it's an army that i wanted to play uh for a long long time ago <laughs> since a long long time ago i'm sorry and uh yeah 